again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of the Holy Stone GPS foldable drone under 249 grams. This is the model HS460, 26 minutes long flight time, brushless motors, follow me, auto return, 5G FPV transmission, and no registration required with the FAA because of that lightweight. This gets excellent customer ratings. You can see the nice holder, it comes in zippered with a handle on the top and a long strap so you can bring it on any adventure you have. Also has a pocket in front where you can actually put other things like even your wallet and other things like that. And uh, it has the holder for the accessories right here. We're gonna open this up and then the drone is packaged uh, nicely to protect it. And then on the bottom right here, there's a styrofoam protector. And here is the actual controller itself. Let's put the, these all out on the table so we can take a closer look. And it also has a little nice mesh pocket where it has a quick start guide and the full manual. Here's everything out of the package. You have the drone itself, the transmitter with the mobile phone cradle, a charger for the transmitter looks like, a drive battery, a charger for the drive battery, USB-A, and screwdriver, extra parts, screws, rotor holders, and extra props. So that's really nice. Let's take a look at the drone itself. And you can see how this works. You open each one of these arms up like that. And then you can see that it has unique design because each one of these props are independent. The movement, and there is the little brushless motor that's rotating in the prop. Has a nice leg stand down there. Let's open up the back right here. And there is a full drone itself right there. Now, if you look on the bottom of this, you do see some image technology right there so that it can look at the uh, ground and your hand and so forth. Those are sensors right there. Here is the front camera and it uh, could be moved up and down. The stabilization for this is not independent on the camera, it's in the software, but it also has the stabilization of the drone itself with the electronics. And there's also sensors built in over there. And I'm sure there's LED lights on here also. There is one of the power switches there and some other uh, LED display going on right there. Um, the legs on the back, there's these white colored legs here. At the front, I have longer ones. So when you set this down, it actually points towards uh, the front, lifting up slightly, helps you with orientation. Charging is really simple. I'm just using one of these USB-A power adapters, and I plugged in the included charging port, and you can see that it is blinking, and when both of uh, those are solid, that green will turn solid, that means it's fully charged. And this is going right into the battery right there, and the adapter is included, has contacts, and the battery itself has a bunch of contacts right there, and all the specifications are laid out right there. So you go like that, you push it in place, and you drop it down, and it clicks, and it connects to the battery, and that's what gives you the charge that's going on and the status indicator. Charging a transmitter is simple. I'm using a USB-A adapter, but I'll put about two amps of current. And on the transmitter itself, there's these legs that you can just drop or drop open. And there is a micro USB port right there. You plug the included cable and you have a red LED right there. You can see and that LED will extinguish when it's fully charged. So while those batteries are charging, let's go over some of the specs of this Holy Stone GPS foldable drone. It's equipped with 100 degrees field of view and 70 degrees remote control which means the up and down 70 degrees. Captures great images. The resolution of the pictures is 3840 by 2160. These are the 5G FPV transmission for smooth and stable videos. And we're gonna be testing this out, see how this all works. Has an intelligent return to home. Enjoy a worry-free worry flying that GPS and automatic return functions. So if it loses the signal, goes out of range, or has low power, it smartly returns home on its own. So that way you can avoid losing your drone, which is something that happens to other drones. Has an extended flight experience of about 26 minutes. And again, these are brushless motors, which means that they run more efficiently. There's no contacts to wear out and worry about 
them losing uh, efficiency over time. It has advanced functions. The app provides various smart functions such as follow me, waypoint, point of interest. So even beginners can control this HS460 GPS 4K drone. It has a low battery warning and two speeds and exceptional quality. That's why it's getting good ratings. And of course it has that shoulder bag and no requirement with the FAA registration. And here the quick guide does have something you can scan where you can get the uh, app, which I'm gonna do. And there's some videos to watch tutorials and there's even instructions on there. So I'm gonna do that. I'm just basically using the quick guide at this point. So here is the app I downloaded and there is preparations on here where you're gonna do a calibration and follow the screen to calibrate the drone. On the drone, if you wanna have your captured footage be able to download to your computer or, or Apple. There is a TF card slot that you can use right on the bottom of the battery bay. Once the battery is charged, it slides in right like that and locks in place. To remove the battery, there is a button right there that you have to push and then the battery will slide out. So I'm gonna try and follow the instructions first for pairing the drone. So let's turn on the drone and you see that the red lights are blinking on the bottom. Make sure it's on a little surface, front that way, back towards you. Short press the transmitter. Now the transmitter is on, you see it blinking green right there. Move the left joystick up and then back down to pair the drone up and then down. So it says it's paired when this goes from flash green to solid color solid green right there. So I'm going to my Wi-Fi and there's the Holy Stone right there. So I do see a camera feed from the drone. You can see as I'm moving the drone in my room here is showing me the actual video. Here I want to demonstrate uh, how the front camera works. I've got the transmitter here on and they're both synced up. So you can see you've got those controls right there and you could hit those and change the camera angle. So there's no gyro on here. And I looked at the, uh, the uh, video that was downloaded to my mobile phone. So I use a program called Media Info. So it's uh, MPEG-4 is the format, and you can see it's about 4,300 uh, 838 kilobits per second right there that's not too bad and it's 1920 by 1080 pixels and it's 25 frames per second that's the video that was uh, sent to my mobile phone from the drone I want to show you when you record video using the transmitter button right there you do get a little indicator right there letting you know that it is recording and you hit the button again and it stops recording so here I'm outside and I'm going to be just trying to drone out the GPS I'm going to be using manual for the steps the first step is pairing so I'm going to turn the drone on then the transmitter I'm going to turn on Blinking LED, I'm going to go full throttle and down. That's solid green. I'm going to get my uh, phone working. So there's the holy stone that came up. So there's the app. You can see I'm in optical mode. I haven't gotten the uh, GPS first working. We're going to do gyro calibration by moving both these joysticks to the bottom right, like that, and it gave me a message here, it was for short lived, but it said gyro calibration is successful. Now we're going to follow the directions, and we're going to uh, long press this button right here. Hear that long beep. This is compass calibration. Spin the drone three times counterclockwise. That 
That's one. That's two. And that's three. Now you point the head of the drone upwards and rotate it three times. That's one. That's two. That's three. And now the display is in GPS mode. So it's ready for flight. And if I uh, pick up the drone and I rotate it like this, I could see that it is rotating on the indicator right there on the software. And you hit this button and it goes into the takeoff mode and the rotors did start to turn. And now if I hit that button again, it's going to take off and hover. And if I hit that button again, it's going to take off and hover. You can also see that it has where I'm located. It's got my street address right there because I'm in my backyard right now. And there you can see it took off. And it's fighting the wind right now. Because it is very windy today, so I'm going to be trying it on a less windy day. But you see it's doing lock and hold, and it's working just fine. And it's very windy. So here it's just hovering, and it's pointing itself into the wind, because it's in GPS lock mode. So it's following the mobile phone essentially and it's uh, doing a good job just fighting the wind essentially and keeping it on track with GPS. So after testing, I want to think about the Holystone GPS foldable drone, the model HS460. Excellent product with a 26 minute long flight. This thing worked fine and I was impressed with it. I couldn't test everything and show you everything. Uh, it was windy as I demonstrated and the video was getting really long, but this thing worked uh, as expected and the video came out great. I was really impressed with the manual because it was extremely well written and accurate and I called customer support a couple times and they answered immediately and answered any of my questions and that's the most important thing with something like this so once again you're getting the battery the drone itself eight spare propellers the tool to put the propellers the hardware the screws the really nice binding transmitter that worked great to hold my phone the charging uh, connections to USB A and the really nice holder that's going to hold everything so that you can bring this on a trip or to a field or just tag along and have it with you anytime you think you're going to be needing some footage and the drone worked excellent i even tried it inside the house i was able to hover inside indoors and the battery did give me that really long flight time uh, so i'm impressed with the overall package you get from uh, holy stone i'm going to give this product a full five star rating 
Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to alert you new video uploads. And if you thought this review was helpful, please hit the like button. There will be an ordering link in the information section of this video review. Please use that link when you order this product to help support this channel. I hope this video review helped you with your buying decision. Thank you for watching.